What's up guys and welcome back to Rise of Mordor Submod. We now have a new uh, faction. We have two new factions and we have hobbits. As you can see, they look like really small men and they are. Look at them compared to like the Greenway, I think it's a Greenway Guard or something like that. And they look so small. We have, these are the rabble over here. I'm pretty sure these, yeah, all of these are just like random rabble. And stuff like that, I think. Oh no, these are Baggins' private guard. He's got his own guard. And then these are the rabble there. And we have archers in the front. But we'll have a quick look at the rest of the uh, rest of the faction while we wait. So these are Breland men at arms, not Greenway guard. These are your Greenway vanguards, which are kind of like the Greenway guard, I guess. Now they're kind of like a double sword, a double-handed sword unit. That's very cool. And then we've got. Uh, yeah, the Breland Men at Arms, they look really cool. They're kind of actually one of my favourite factions now uh, in this sub mod. And then uh, I really like these uh, merchant bodyguards as well. They look very good. They remind me of the um, of the Saxons from uh, from uh, the main Attila game. They look very much like the Saxons. And then we have um, Greenway. I think these are Greenway Marksmen. A Breland Gatesman, that's what they are. I can't. There's so many factions now and faction units that I just can never get the names right. So we've got Breland, Breland Gatesman, they look very nice. And then we've got. Oh, how could we forget the Hobbit Archers? You want to. Everyone wants to see the Hobbit Archers. Where are they? Here they are. Hobbit Archers. These small little boys. They don't look very. They look still quite manly. Not very childlike, but you know, we can live with that. And then over here we have still more of them. We have our own uh, Dunedain Woodlanders, so they are ready for battle. And then in the rear over here we have do we have more Greenway Vanguard? Oh god! Oh, we have these guys at the back though. We have uh, two-handed uh, axemen, well, more like falcsmen. Um, more hobbits here, so the followers of Banderbrass. And these guys. Got all sort of assorted weapons, sort of clubs, falxes, small axes, and then we have the spears, which are very much like uh, the the guards, uh, the men at arms, but just for spears. And then we have cavalry on the flanks, and these guys are very good. Greenway lancers, looking excellent, to be honest. So yes, as you can see, if you've read the uh, thumbnail, there is another new faction. We've seen them in all past uh, Lord of the Rings battle. Which, and it's the goblins. They've been redone in the time that I last did them. So they were um, some raiders that had gone in, gone in there. And some goblin, like, I think they're goblin uh, stalkers. That's what they are. Then we have heavy archers getting into position. All of them now have, like, heavy looking armor. So we have archers here. Uh, infantry with their cool shields. Look at them and their armor. It just looks a little, so much better. We don't have the weird whiteness anymore. We're now pikes here getting into position. They looked awesome. Look at all these guys. They look awesome. Spears and pikes. And these are blood re uh, blood reavers. These are like a heavy axe unit. And we have got to have the rabble the enemy has laid an here. They haven't really laid an ambush. They've just kind of done some stuff. I'm going to put these cavalry wide. While we wait, and I'll put these cavalry wide so they don't just get trodden on. So, yeah, and then we've got more. I think, got what these guys are. Oh, spear throwers. Yeah, we now have more, uh, sort of like javies and stuff. So, we've got plenty of raiders and stuff like that. So, it's going to be a close battle. It is power, balance power says it'll be very close. And that's not to be, that's to be expected. So, anyway, we'll put it back to normal speed. These guys can charge in here. These guys charging here. Excellent. Right, they hold the line. Everyone else hold the line. It's the hobbits are going to be the problem. Uh, can the cavalry not just get shot inside anymore? Thank you. Oh, already look at that. They break. Goblin raid is just not very good. More of like a a flanking unit, I have a feeling. Um, let's send. Oh, all these. All, all, not all the spears have been used up. Right. Well, we'll send you in here because there's a lot of guys here. Um, lots of guys here. Focus all fire here. Focus. 
focus fire. So anyway, let's get a close up of the battle. Let's see these uh, guys in action. It's the problem with the tiller is it's still very dark, so you still have a bit of a problem when it comes to seeing the enemy, like the bad guys. But oh, not this way. Oh, that looks good. So yes, uh, li literally as I put this video out, I got a reply from the sub modders, uh, very kind of them saying that we are they are redoing uh, the goblins. So. That is good to see. Oh, look at that. There's like the hobbits are in there already. Charging around. They look so silly. Just next to the like huge men. But it looks perfect. Oh, that is amazing. Right. So anyway, they're holding the line there. Oh, these pikes broke. Keep shooting these pikes. Shoot these pikes. They're just like very much in the open. Okay, so they're... Oh, all these have been killed off. These cavalry really needs to retreat. Run those, ca those guys down, boys. Uh, the general can come up here. Uh, we need you over here. Spears in here. And you might be needed here as well. In the center a bit. The center is kind of breaking for us. But apart from that, we're doing okay. Oh gosh, our center is well and truly broken. Uh, let's break some guys in the back, please. Oh gosh, okay. So, well, the goblins have definitely got souped up then. Because they're a lot stronger than um, quite a lot of my units. So, I'm going to send in a lot of stuff early on. But cavalry, the goblins still don't have any cavalry or anything like that. So no wargs or anything like that. So we, all these cavalry are in some trouble. There we go, got them out. Okay, right. Where is my other unit cavalry? Oh, they're in combat, okay. Uh, let's send them into the goblin warriors. This is the general unit. Can they make it in time? Yes, they can. Excellent, right. They're probably not best staying there, though. No, they're not. Get out of there. Okay, well, now the battle seems to turn in our favor a bit more. Right, so we'll send you in the rear here. Axe is here. Oh, the enemies killed our general. No. Not good. Um, run away. Oh dear, not looking good. And that's a whole the whole Bowman unit broke. Oh no! Come on, guys. There's no no need to flee yet. Right, and now we're going very like hard on what needs to be done. Right, let's go and get their general. These cavalry are really quick though, so we should break everything. Excellent. Well, they shouldn't be. Keep them going. Come on, boys, into b battle. Oh, why are we the guy at the back? Come on. Yep. Now let's kill their general. Let's kill their general. Let's see if we can turn this around. I mean, it m looks like most of my cavalry are just happy to stand there. Okay, all you guys are going to be needed in killing this general. And then we might be able to route... There's okay. Where um, are you winning that battle? You are just about. 
Um, you might as well just shoot there, right. Excellent. Right, so I hope you've uh, enjoyed the battle. If you have, please remember to like and subscribe. It looks like we could turn this one around. Finally, the Shire will be defended. Their general has fallen. Excellent. There we go. They won't stand long. These boys. And there we go. Victory is ours. The Shire has been defended. And you get to see two excellent uh, new factions battle it out. There is another new faction that has kind of been separated in the sub mod that is Darwinian. I will be planning to do another battle on that. And I'm sorry if you've uh, if you've seen a lot of Rise of Mordor at the moment, but it, there's a lot going on in the mod at the moment and in the sub mod. So that's why we're uh, doing a lot of it. Let's go and check the end game stats quickly. So we lost only about 900, nearly a thousand. Um, so that's not too bad. We killed a lot of theirs off. The Moria faction uh, for goblins is just amazing. Yeah, the goblins have now been. Re I forgot that they've been renamed Moria. Um, we lost a lot of <laughs> our Greenway Vanguards, but I mean, most of the units doing very, very well. 200 with those Greenway Vanguards. 200 with those men at arms. The cavalry saving the day with 300, nearly 200 with that one. Um, goblins doing fairly well. Their pikes were actually very effective. And so their goblin warriors and their warmongers, which are like their elite uh, swords, I think. So they did very well. The spears doing okay, and the archers I went straight for, so they never got a chance of killing anyone. And goblin rabble, uh, feral, um, feral goblins getting no kills, but they're just there to soak up the fire, aren't they, really? But anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed that video, then leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here to join the Papal Legion. And until next time, guys, bye for now.